Oliver, I don't know where you've disappeared to, but I'm already low on one superhero today. Chloe thinks I'm crazy, and I'm low on clues as to why some she ninja is after me. Call me. Good find. Look, on a scale of one to ten of illegal things I've done in my life, this doesn't even hit the radar. Okay, that didn't exactly come out right. All I'm saying is you and your big boys in blue have bigger fish to fry than this little guppy, so I'm just gonna... How about a name? Lois Lane, Daily Planet. You're the reporter that's been missing for three weeks? Missing? What the hell are you talking about? What day is it? It's Friday, the 25th. What? Where the hell have I been for three weeks? <laughs> I was kind of hoping you'd tell me. You were MIA until your name came up on the list of crash victims. Now, do you remember anything last night that would explain how a seven-ton sky train belly flops onto Main Street without a single fatality? Guess we just need to chalk it up to a modern-day miracle. We could, or we could chalk it up to a uh, vigilante on an ego trip. Oh, is that what we call courage these days? The infamous blur. You know, the ends don't always justify the means. You might want to stick to your night job, detective. Graffiti's not exactly the Red Blue Blur's style. Yeah, you're right. Never used to be, back when the guy was happy pulling off a few modest saves, but then suddenly there was no red or blue, it was just the blur. Now he feels the need to leave his mark all over the city to, I don't know, prove something. Great, the rest of you are pausing to interrogate me to... Hey! You two want membership in the Mile Long Club, you might want to try one that's still on the tracks. Let's get out of here. Okay, officer. Not bad. 